ArcGIS online tool for spatial analysis. So as we know, uh, we have ArcGIS online tools that are used to perform different spatial analysis to solve spatial questions. Like we have uh, ArcGIS analysis tool used to uh, compute different uh, geostatistical analysis. So today we will see how to use ArcGIS Pro, uh, ArcGIS online tool for uh, geostatistical interpolation. So here I have logged into my uh, account in ArcGIS online. As you can see here we have different tools and options to analyze our data. Here I have added my uh, annual PM 2.5 monitoring site or air quality data in a point format and I have a shape file for this specific area. You can add your data to this ArcGIS online by using this option. You can mm, go or you can drive from your uh, file just using this option. So or also you can add from your Google Drive or Dropbox or uh, OneDrives. So I have already added the data here. So as you can see, you have different options and uh, different analysis uh, tools to perform uh, different spatial analysis uh, tasks. So here for today, we are going to use the interpolation tool to create a raster surface or to predict the amount of air quality for this specific area. So once you have added your data, uh, you can check or you can explore the data by just uh, checking the attributes or different uh, property of the data. You can open the table of the data and uh, you can see the uh, data so the attributes uh, or fields in your data. Here I have average uh, yearly PM 2.5 uh, data value for this uh, for each point data around this point. So we are going to use this data to create or to predict the areas that has uh, highest air quality uh, value. So to do this, we have uh, ArcGIS analysis tool. So come to this side. Here, as you can see, you have different options. You can check the property of the data or the layer. You can also use the styling or you can change the display of the data. You can filter, you can uh, just filter the attribute of the data or the data that you are uh, use that you need to uh, display. Here, uh, the tool that we are going to use is the analyze tool here. Once you have opened uh, you can just select this analyze tool. Under this, we have different spatial analysis tool like uh, spatial hotspot analysis or different data summarizing option or finding location or searching by or finding by attributes, data enrichment or joining data from JS or ArcGIS living at last. We can also use this ana analyzing pattern data or we can use this. Uh, proximity or uh, distance calculation you can also use this manage or data management so each this analysis has their own uh, processing options you can use this summarizing data for joining features or summarizing center or uh, dispersion you can use also this summarizing the nearby data so we can also use this one, which is uh, finding location or choosing the best facilities or creating view sheets, creating water sheets, or you can use the uh, trace downstream. These, these tools are also available in this ArcGIS online. Data enrichment, you can add uh, attribute data to your data or your uh, file. You can also use this analyze pattern. So for today, we are going to use this option, which is uh, analyzing pattern under this we have different tools for example you can use this comp calculate composite index or you can calculate densities or height hot spots out layers so for today we are going to use the uh, geostatistical interpolation which is a uh, point interpolation to ex to estimate or to create a raster surface that represent or that shows the pm 2.5 values for these uh, areas so just select these interpolate pointers 
So this PM 2.5 data is uh, often collected uh, through the monitoring stations or uh, using satellite observation and they, they are used to assess air quality and that is impact on the public health and the, the natural environment. So uh, we are going to interpolate these point features to create a raster air quality surface. So in this uh, two option you are going to give the input layer so just click this plus layer there our input will be the point data which is annual pm 2.5 monitoring station then uh, for this uh, field to interpolate you have to select the attributes or the field that you are going to use for the interpolation so here i'm going to use the attribute that is uh, yearly average PM 2.5 data or value then you, are, you can specify the processing is extent just by using your steady area so this is my layer select the polygon so for the calculation of the precision you can use one of these three options so for uh, this is tutorial I'm going to use this speed option to save the processing time for the classification you can select one of these options equal area or equal interval or manual so I'm going to use this uh, equal interval in number of class will be 10 you can change the numbers of class so uh, we will use this uh, ArcGIS online interpolate point tool to predict values at uh, a new location based on the measurement found on the collection of this point data. So the analysis will return uh, areas classified by uh, predicted value or interpolated value. So once you have entered your uh, parameters and you specified some parameters you can just give the output name then finally you can run the process you can check the history tab to see the uh, process or the running process so the map display is updated and uh, shows the range of the predicted uh, pm 2.5 exposure value so by just by interpolating the points allows us to clearly see the pattern of the pm 2.5 values across the entire area so here we get the raster interpolated surface you can uncheck the visibility of these layers as you can see it can create the raster surface that shows the amount of the air quality around these points in 5 or in 10 classes so you can just change the property or the display of so as you can see we have the chain 10 classes so you can check also the attribute of the output data you can just click the show table so it shows the range of the pm value or pm 2.5 uh, value so the highest value will be the 6.37 and the highest value is 19.11 so just by using this ArcGIS uh, online analysis tool you can perform such kind of spatial analysis or geostatistical interpolation to create a raster interpolated surface for uh, analysis so this is all about my tool so see you in the next video.